नमस्कार स्टूडेंट्स सो दिस इज द थर्ड वीडियो फॉर द चैप्टर ट्रांसपोर्टेशन इन प्लांट्स एंड एनिमल्स द टॉपिक विच वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस इज एक्सक्रीशन ड्यूरिंग द वेरियस लाइफ एक्टिविटीज लाइक रेस्पिरेशन एंड डाइजेशन ऑफ फूड लॉट ऑफ वेस्ट मटीरियल्स आर जनरेटेड बाय द बॉडी दीज एक्टिविटीज दे आर कॉल्ड एज मेटाबॉलिक एक्टिविटीज दीज वेस्ट मटीरियल्स इफ दे आर अलाउड टू एक्यूमुलेट इन द बॉडी दे कैन बी हार्मफुल टू अस एंड कैन कॉज वेरियस डिजीजेस so the process required to get rid of this these waste materials is called as excretion in human beings we have a well developed system but in plants also there are various excretory products like they excrete the excess water in the form of water vapor through transpiration but in many plants you will come to know that there are, there are different types of excretory products like lac resin latex gum rubber so all these are excretory products in plants so about human beings we have two different terms ejection versus excretion ejection is the term which we have discussed in our chapter nutrition in animals ejection is removal of the solid waste from the body that is the undigested matter is eliminated out of the body it is one of the steps of nutrition today we will be learning about how excretion occurs in human beings it could take place from lungs respiration we release carbon dioxide through skin that is through sweat glands we get rid of different salts water kidneys they remove in the form of urine now how kidneys work kidneys they consist of a pair that is two every human body it has a pair of kidneys which is connected to the urinary bladder through the two tubes called as ureter now these kidneys they are consisting of tiny filtering units called as nephrons these nephrons they actually act like a filter paper if i put an impure solution on a filter paper i can filter out the water and the impurity separately similarly as you can see here in the picture the kid when the impure blood it reaches to the kidney it gets filtered transported through the ureter stored in the urinary bladder and from there it is can be excreted out through urethra here in this picture you can see the kidney is being connected with a blood vessel which is going to bring the impure blood and one blood vessel which is going to get take away the pure one so whatever is filtered out that is the urea 5% of the urine it consists of water rest 5% out of two that 2.5% is urea and 2.5% is remaining salts so here a structure of nephron is also shared nephrons are the tiny filtering units which help in filtering the impurities out of our body one more mode of excretion we have is sweat glands or the sebaceous glands these glands they help in eliminating out the excess water along with that some salts are also excreted out and it helps down in cooling the body evaporation of the sweat brings a cooling effect so today we have learned about how excretion occurs in human beings how the urinary system in human body is helpful to eliminate out the waste products because accumulation of toxic materials in the body can be harmful and can cause lot of diseases to us so in human body we have three modes of excretion one is lungs second is urinary system that is the kidneys and the third is the sweat glands this much for today thank you